Work Day Row. Um, hope you're having an awesome day today. Gosh, when I start thinking about memories with you over the last 25, 26 years, there are a lot of really funny ones, uh, whether it be Mardi Gras at your parents' house, I think on 6th Street, and uh, having to climb over the wall at night after being locked out, or uh, whether it was in the rec center pool at Vanderbilt trying to learn how to flip a kayak and being stuck upside down in the pool waiting on you to come flip us over, or our first kayaking trip down a river in Alabama on a 30 degree day pouring down rain, uh, or the year that we lived in the Tridel house, or the year on Woodmont. Um, many, many fun times. Uh, loved your friendship over the last 25 years. What I most admire about you is your realness and your kindness to everyone that you meet. I don't think that you ever meet a stranger and you treat everyone uh, that you meet with respect and look for the good in everyone. And I appreciate that. That's rare to find in people. So I love you. Hope to see you soon. Have a wonderful day. Hey, Ro, happy birthday. When I was thinking about what I appreciate most about you, I realized what I appreciate most about you is our 36 years of friendship. Fourth grade, 10 years old, we have been friends for 36 years. It is truly a lifetime. And what I appreciate most about you is you're exactly where you need to be every time I need you. You do friendship like you do everything else in your life 100% and you are the best. You are truly the best friend ever and I don't know how I'd make it through stuff without you. I really don't. I love you. I love your sweet family and your sweet husband and I hope you have the best 46th birthday ever. Sorry I tried not to be teary but couldn't help it. I love you. Have a great night. <laughs> Happy, Happy birthday, birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Rowan. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, Ro. Happy love birthday. you. Happy birthday, Ro. I love you. We've been friends a long, long time. I love you so much. I love your heart. Thank you for loving me. Roanne, happy birthday. When I think of you and all of the special things about you, I think what I always remember is from childhood that you were always fearless. You are the reason why Matil and I took swimming. I think why we went ahead in the um, canoeing program. And I think I can trade that later on to why I ran marathons because if Roanne said I could do it, then I knew I could. I have always thought that you have just the most wonderful heart of gold and really one of the things that I've loved so much about my life is that growing up in New Orleans and then going to college in Ohio and then marrying someone in Ohio that Nashville has always been a halfway point and when I look and see who I've stayed with more than anybody in my life I think it might be you I love you I love your spirit I love your sense of humor and I wish you the very happiest of birthdays well, one thing I like most about Rover is she always nice to us at family dinner I like Lolo because he has Jen's little family. One thing I like about Roro is whenever we come to her house for family dinner, she always has something good to eat. Three feet of fresh powder, 27 years of friendship, and now 46 birthdays. So many reasons to celebrate today. Happy birthday, Ro. It's so amazing to have a lifelong friend and a soulmate. I miss you. I wish you the best. I have a, hope you have a great day and a great year. Hey, Roanne. Happy birthday. Um, I am so lucky to have had you as a friend for so long. The first time we met was at the um, water fountain at, on Stapleton 3 at Vanderbilt, and that was a long time ago. Um, I admire your strength, and I love your sense of humor, and I just um, love you. So happy birthday. Oh, happy 46th birthday. I hope that you have a really fabulous celebration and that this year is full of love and laughter. There are so many things that I love about you. Um, I'll name just a couple of couple here. One is how you are so ready to embrace new adventures and experiences and people. And I love that openness of spirit that you have. 
I also really love how authentic you are and how you keep it real. And that's really great. I love that too. So I'm wishing you all the best at 46 and for all the years to come. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, Ro! I love you so much, and I think that's evident by the fact that I'm sitting in my room by myself recording a video to you. Um, I think this is an awesome idea, and I can't believe that we have been friends for well over 26 years, all beginning really back in the Delta house and being your roommate. And um, I've considered that our friendship is a yin-yang. Um, and we bring out the best in each other. Um, you with all your energy and your um, inability to say no to the sign-up sheet and me constantly, you know, trying to get you to slow down. I think after 26 years, I've realized that's not going to happen. And that's what inspires me. Um, you inspire me because your ability to do and go for whatever it is you want to do, whether it's get your yoga certification or make jewelry or start a business or run a marathon or mini mar marathons, um, you are amazing in that way. Um, I love that we have shared life together. We have um, gone to college together. We've married Nashville boys. We have had babies together we've raised our kids together we um, are, have tried to raise our parents which hasn't always gone so well um, but I love that you're my first call and in, in times of joy and times of sorrow and I love that we have jumped off a mountain together and we can lay our yoga mat side by side and um, I just look forward to many many more years of our friendship and really can't imagine my life without you i love you um you should be so proud of yourself and your beautiful family and um i look forward to celebrating with you happy happy birthday love you so much hey rory happy birthday hope you have a great day happy birthday to our favorite yogi and running mate we love you namaste hi ro happy birthday Remember this song, meet new friends, but keep the old. One is silver and the other is gold. Well, guess what? You are gold inside and out. Thanks for your friendship and all these years. Happy birthday. The reason I didn't get up and go to yoga this morning was so that I could prepare for this video. You see that I'm in my pajamas to tell you how much I love you. And I'm glad that you've been with us on this planet for 46 years. And I think about when we first really, really got to be best friends and know that we were separated from birth was um, when you called that fateful day when I was in Hilton Head to say, why don't you come do Hood to Coast with us? And I thought, you are freaking crazy. I'm not doing that. And it was one of the best experiences of my life. And it led me to you. So happy, happy birthday. Hope it's a great one. I'll be with you, so of course it will be. Cheers, I love you. Happy birthday, Rowan. I love you so much. Happy birthday, Rowan! <laughs> <laughs> Happy birthday! Hey, Ro, you're a powerhouse, an originator, an idea maker, an inspirer, a creator, a giver, and a dear friend. You make the world a more colorful place. Happy birthday! Happy, happy birthday. Thanks for being such a great friend. I appreciate you so much because everything you do inspires me. You do it with grace and beauty. And I also want to thank you for being such a wonderful friend for so many years. Happy birthday. 
Hey bro, I'm excited to get to wish you a happy birthday. I want you to know that you are someone who is very loved. You're a devoted wife, a wonderful mother to three, and a great friend to lots of people. But you are my only sister. And I get the privilege of being your only sister. And I really hit the jackpot. You're in all of my favorite childhood memories. And I am certainly blessed to have shared all the trials of adulthood with you and all that entails. I want to thank you for being there to answer all of my silly questions and all of my hard ones too. I'm beyond proud to call you my sister and to know you certainly make 46 look awesome. We hope you have a wonderful birthday and make it a great weekend. We love Happy you, Aunt Rose. You're going to sing? Yeah. Happy, Happy birthday, birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Rowan. Happy birthday to you. We love you. A lot. Hello, my name's Bill Main, and I'm executive director of Country Radio Broadcasters here in Nashville. Uh, boy, I could spend hours talking about Rowan. Um, I think I may have been Rowan's first employer, hiring her at, right out of Vanderbilt. Uh, and she worked as my assistant and um, that was a long time ago and uh, to answer the first question of, of uh, what do I think of when I think of Rowan and my favorite thing is her incredible spirit, her incredible creativity, her heart. She's one of the most wonderful people I've been blessed to have in my life and uh, as far as a, a funny story about Rowan She's going to kill me for this one, uh, but it is the funniest one I can recall and never will forget, nor will she, I think. She'd been uh, working with me for probably a month, and I had a friend of mine who was vice president for Target um, who lived in Detroit, and Madonna was uh, playing the palace at Auburn Hills and had wanted to take his wife to see Madonna. So I got on the phone with my compatriots in Burbank and got front row tickets for them. And I gave them to Rowan and said, here's the address, get these tickets. It's for the show on Friday. And um, a couple days later, I got a call from my friend going, did you send those tickets? And I called Rowan in and I said, you sent those, right? And she said, yes. And I said, well, they haven't gotten them yet. And that's strange. And I said, you did FedEx them, right? And she turned green and said, no. And I said, you didn't put them in snail mail, did you? And uh, of course she did. And uh, those tickets went unused. Uh, but uh, I love you, Ro. And I hope you have the happiest 46th. And many, many more. Hooray, 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 today, today's your birthday. It's not the beavers or the bears, it's not the pickles or the pears, it's not next week or yesterday, today, today's your birthday. Happy birthday, Rowan. I love you so much. You are one of my favorite people because you're always dependable. You always show up. You're smart. You're funny. You're beautiful. And you feel like home. I love you. Happy birthday. Hello. We can see ourselves. Happy birthday to my yoga teaching, jewelry making, art selling, marathon running, soccer coaching, jambalaya making, all around booty kicking friends. I'm just hanging out wearing a few of my favorite things, favorite pieces of jewelry, my bracelet. Rowan, these are a few of the reasons I love you. I'm so lucky to be your friend. I'm so blessed the way you love me and my girls. But I'm gonna need you to stop overachieving in the 46th year. You've done enough, you've accomplished enough, and it's time to slow down. You're putting too much pressure on the rest of us. 
Oh, look, there's Moose back there. Have a happy birthday. I wish you were here to train my dog not to go on the sofa. I know you would do that. But I love you. I hope this is a great one. And I look forward to many, many, many more. Love you. Bye-bye. Oh my gosh, I feel like such a goofball doing this. And I'm embarrassed of how I look. But this is what you get since I waited till the last minute to record my tribute to you, Ro. So I'm sorry that I'm dirty and post-exercise, but this is how you know me anyway. So I just wanna wish you a happy, happy, happy birthday. I can't wait till we celebrate together in our annual way that we do. It's means so much to me and I love having that excuse every year to get together with you and wish you happy birthday so we will do that together but until then this is my contribution to your video and I just want to tell you happy birthday and that you know I love you because I would not do a video looking like this or even do this I won't even look at myself on my phone let alone make a video so I'm just showing you how much I love you by being here and you yeah. scaring you um what do i appreciate most about you and what is my favorite memory with you how could i even begin to say what all of that is in three minutes as that timer clicks off right in my face but what i think i appreciate the most about you ro is what a good friend you are and what a great listener you are oh my god how much do i owe you in the therapy you've given me over the years about my family and everything else um i just appreciate your openness and your willingness to listen and your really good therapeutic skills i will tell you you missed your calling or maybe you didn't now that you're a yoga teacher and you're going to weave that in but I, um, I, I, I just appreciate what a good friend you've been to me through the years in so many ways. Um, the favorite memories I have, you know, are always going to be about yoga. Well, maybe not always, but those are the ones coming to mind right now. Our first trip to the yoga festival, or what was that called? The yoga, what was it? Anyway, you know what I'm talking about. And then, of course, our yoga retreat. We can't forget that. Namaste. Um, and uh, that, that just doesn't even feel right to say those are my favorite memories because we have so many and I know we have so many to come as well. Um, but I guess I will just say I love you and happy birthday. And I'm honored to be a part of this video and how lucky for everyone else that they are going to shine in comparison to this nastiness. Okay. I love you, Ro. You look fabulous in this little picture I'm looking at of you. and. The, um, I know you're going to have a great birthday, and what a sweet husband to put this together for you. I'm just sorry I waited so long to do it. But from my heart, I love you, and happy birthday. Bye. Happy birthday, Roanne. I hope you have a wonderful birthday. What I appreciate most about you is everything. You're always a, a, someone to laugh with, a shoulder to cry on, um, a big hug, and a listening ear. And you are just all the most wonderful characteristics rolled up into one person. I love you. Happy birthday. Hey, Rowan. Happy birthday. I hope you're feeling the love with this video that Jay made for you. I just wanted you to know that I feel so lucky to have you in my life. Um, you're beautiful and smart and funny and fun to be around. You're so creative and so energetic. I mean, you've got more energy in one pinky than most of us do in our entire body. You know how to throw it down on the dance floor, especially when you're wearing those apple bottom jeans and the boots with the fur. But for me, the thing I love about you most is that you've really raised the bar for all of us in terms of what it means to be a friend. 
You are always there for your peeps with a word of encouragement, a word of advice, support, or just making us all laugh. And for that, I am supremely grateful. So have a wonderful day. I love you. Hi, Roran. Happy birthday. I have so many fun memories of our great Camp Marywood adventures. It's hard to say what my favorite would be, but I think it might be the Gates of Lador adventure from the summer of 2006. With some great camp friends in an amazingly beautiful place. Camping, hiking, paddling, and just enjoying each other's company on the Green River in Utah was such a great experience and a memory that'll last a lifetime. Maybe one day we'll get to go back and do it again with our families. I love you, my friend, and I hope you have a wonderful birthday. Happy birthday, ro, -Ro. Mm -hmm. We love you. Happy birthday, ro -Ann. Um, I hope you have and have had a great birthday. Um, I am just really glad that you were born. Um, I also want to say how much I appreciate you in my life. I feel like you and I, our paths were supposed to cross and I am so thankful they did and that we got to spend all that good time together screaming and yelling with the Red Hots in those early years. Um, so much fun. But I really wanna say that um, aside from your wit, your intellect, sharp intellect, I should say, um, how much fun you are, on and on and on. I think the thing that really stands out to me when I think about you and what I appreciate so much about you in a friend is that when I am with you or talking to you, you are an amazing listener, and I can tell that you are listening. You are not thinking about anything else, or you sure don't seem to be, and you're an amazing friend in that way, and it's just a unique quality. So I wanna thank you for that. I wanna thank you for letting me be a part of your life, and again, I wish you a happy, happy 46th birthday. Happy birthday, Rowan. Happy birthday. Let's be clear. We would not put ourselves on camera for just anyone. No way. No. We appreciate you. We love you. And we love doing life with you. Absolutely. We're so we're, we're going to jump on in. I, I, say, I say we move ahead with memories. 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 Let's talk about memories. Yes. Yes. Right. You met Marianne Vanderbilt, right? Oh gosh, no, no. She's she's much much older than me. She was gone. Oh gosh, gone There's before, no way. way before. Yeah, There's before no I even way. applied. There is no way. So yeah, she's forty eight. How do you know? How where did you meet her? Well, actually, I met Rowan running marathons. Oh yeah. And oh. I, you know what? I remember that first marathon we ran. I, I crossed the finish line, you know, minutes minutes before she did. But I, I looked back, way back, miles back, could see her coming up and. Oh, I remember I, that. I turned around, yeah. You and guys her. came to one of the first classes that I taught yoga. Uh, Afterwards, yes, yeah, stretched yes, it out. Yes, stretched yes. it breathing. I got you centered. I got you yeah. centered. Next day, you were headed to that, what was that called? That was uh, uh, the Hood to Coast race. Oh, yeah. I did I did that one by myself. Oh, Rowan was driving the van. And oh, that selfless. Dangerous. She stayed up all night she driving while I ran. Sunburned. But you got so sunburned, didn't you? Yes. And I, you know what? You know what that sunburn reminds me of? That sunburn you used to get. Coaching. When I coach soccer, yes, I that coach soccer those red hot years, years, years. Practices, tournaments. Oh, oh love it. it. We, we appreciate it. that. Loved it. Where did you get those? Where did oh, you get those? Oh, these earrings. These earrings right here. Those are gorgeous. I made them. Yeah, oh, I love yeah, it. I made love them. Yeah, it, you know, it's just something I'm dabbling in. You know what? I wish you would make me a pair like the ones here that I saw on Style Blueprint. I made those. They're yeah, gorgeous. Little, little, little pop of color. I don't know if you can see that. Little, little pop of color. You know what? Yeah. I wish I was more artistic. I'm actually dabbling in art right now. <gasps> you want? I am. Let me see. Let me share a piece. What do you think? It's called Blue. It's called Blue Blue Kitty. Kelly, I'm going to tell you something. I am starting a new art business as well. Get Let, I'm gonna, out. I'm going to send you the link. I'm going to represent you. I'm gonna have people all over Nashville clamoring for your art. I'm sending you the website. Please, please. We'll do. Please. Thank you. I will. 
The oh, oh, no, I don't do casserole. I don't do casserole. I'm so sorry. It's paleo. Oh, paleo. Great. You know, I wrote an article about paleo. I, you told me about it that same. You told me about that. George's. George's yeah. Who's that? I'm sorry. I've got a phone call. Do you mind? Oh, real oh, quick. Reese. Yes. Oh, oh, take that. Take that. Hey, Reese. How are you? Hey, listen, I'm talking with someone right now. I'll have to call you back and talk about that Draper J stuff, okay? All right, bye girl. Okay, no, listen, we need to get back to the video. Let's talk about, let's, let's really, I want us to talk about the favorite memory that we have together with Rowan, and you know what that is? Camp. Happy birthday, Rowan. This tribute comes from Austin, Texas. What I most appreciate about you is your drive. And I say that because your drive is what inspires me when I see you today. I see you in action. I see your creativity. I see your, your interest in finding new pathways, new opportunities. I see that all wrapped up into your positive attitude, your years of experience, but yet it's your drive. As someone who wants to rediscover herself, wants to contribute, wants to, wants to keep on ticking and to keep on being. And I appreciate that so much because it is inspiring to me. My greatest, fondest memory is something that happened more recently because I'm older than you and my memory is short, but it's because you and my eldest child are both in Nashville and you are my son's Nashville mom and you have provided him so much support and so much love and so much gracious hospitality. And I am just thinking about when you and I had to go and stalk the fraternity house where he had decided to hang out. And we were tired. We wanted to go home and we wanted to pick him up. And we parked ourselves outside the fraternity house and pretty much said, get out here. We almost went in and thought better of it. But I just wanted to say that's a fond recent memory. And there are many, many others. I just wanted to share that one with you because it makes me smile. See you soon in Nashville, and again, happy birthday. Ode to Rowe. Of all the memories I have of you, so many stand out, some old and some new. New friends at Vandy on Stapleton 3, cute girl in Siberia, working on that communications degree. Studying at night in that awful Surratt, the engine with sticky fingers, we sure had that studying down pat. New Year's in New Orleans, fun times at Withers Lake, all the way to Cali and San Felipe, dancing to Roxanne until daybreak. You taught me how to smile and laugh through it all. You reminded me that sometimes it just sucks is the mantra when bad times call. Ro, we cried and giggled through good times and bad. You're supporting me in everything. Oh, the fun we have had. If only the good die young and there must be some mistake because we're getting old and you're one of the greats. So raise a glass, take a shot, stand a keg, and chug a beer. Ro is just getting started. Here's to another great year. Happy birthday, Ro. I love you. Hi, Rowan. Happy birthday. I hope you have an amazing day and hope there are lots of little surprises coming your way today. I just want to say how grateful I am for your friendship and for Stapleton 3. Little did we know that God had a special plan for us when he put us together in that hall in August of 1989, and I am truly thankful for that. Um, I just cherish each and every one of those friendships and so blessed that we are all able to travel together and take little getaways and I cherish all those memories so much and look forward to many, many more. Um, I hope that you have the best year. I am wishing you a year full of happiness and joy and laughter and healthiness. Um, I love you so much and I miss you and happy birthday. Love you, Ro. Happy birthday, Roanne McIntyre McKnight. We are sending you love and best wishes from the West Coast. It's Merriman here, and I'm hoping you have a great day and evening with family and friends. You always inspire me with your boundless energy. No challenge is too large for you. Um, you're a great, supportive, loyal friend, always up for fun with your wit and intellect. I'm so grateful for that. I have amazing memories of times um, from McGee's, and all over the years from when we were younger and older and starting with the T10 and Dauphin Island, the Skip It Icebreakers and then V8 and Fireballs at May Day and the World's Fair. Um, you being the first to get your license and schlepping us all around in the wagon and then college and weddings and girls trips to Santa Fe and Florida and New York 
and getting to have quality time with you in Big Sur after the marathon was awesome. My most memorable moments are definitely all associated with the McIntyre Mardi Gras, which is just awesome times always from when we were younger to older and your parents and whole family being so open and welcome and I love all of those treasured times and I'm super appreciative and you are the first of us to turn 35. Happy birthday, Rowan. Rowan, you are my role model of resiliency. You are tough, but in all the tender-hearted ways, which is why I love you so dearly for all these years. And I wish I could be with you to celebrate in your big special day, but every day is a special day in my life because Rowan McIntyre McKnight is part of it and you will always be cherished. And one of the things I love about you the most is that no matter what, I know you would put on your superwoman cape and swoop into North Carolina and give your rat a big hug and put my heart back together if it hurt or laugh with me if I needed joy. I love you. Cheers to you, bro. Happy birthday, Ro. You know, the things that I've always appreciated about you are how determined and driven and passionate you are across all aspects of your life. From day one, when we met at Stapleton 3, you were doing so many different interesting things, whether it was playing soccer, kayaking, um, being involved in so many different things that you were so passionate about and that really carries over to all aspects of your life and has continued to do so into your adulthood. You're an amazing mom. Uh, you've always followed your passion and, and your pursuits. You've uncovered some amazing new friends and uh, new creative outlets through jewelry, through art. You're just an amazing person. What can I say? I'm so honored to be your friend and wish I could be there now for your birthday. Have a happy, happy, happy 46th year. I love you. Hi. Um feel kind of silly standing in my backyard um, talking to my phone but uh, Jay thank you for this opportunity to be able to say how much Rowan um, Rowan how much you mean to us and um, you are such a dear friend I, th I think our friendship was originally kind of solidified through running you were my coach my mentor everything through my first and um, maybe last but first marathon um, and really just by my side every step um, no matter what the weather no matter um, how big the hill all of it you were you were right there and then over the years you really just proved that that is um, it's kind of the perfect metaphor uh, you gave me that book long ago the mile markers book but talked about um, you know how how running is is very closely um, symbolizes life and and all the different um, milestones that we go through as kids and then adults and then parents and um, children of aging parents, all of it. Um, and again, you're just right there. You you um, you're so strong. You're such a rock, and you're there for everybody. And um, there's no job too big. There's no um, challenge too great. And I am incredibly blessed to have you as a friend. And I hope you have a wonderful, wonderful birthday. Hey, Rowie, happy birthday! I just want you to know on your birthday that you are so special to me, and that I am in awe of your ability to multitask better than anybody I've ever seen. You are an amazing wife, mother, friend, volunteer, jewelry maker, employee, yoga instructor. I, I really don't know how you do it all and I'm always in awe of you. Um, and some of my favorite memories are of course our trip to Spain which was awesome when you do another trip. 
and all of our fun runs over the years. Of course, I've loved all those, our trips to Naples and all of our fun times together. So I look forward to many more. Hope you have a great day. Love you. Happy birthday. Bro, happy birthday. I hope you're feeling lots of love today. I want you to know how grateful I am for your friendship. It means so much to me. And um, I am so appreciative of how you're always there for me. You're always there for all your friends. But you have always been such a genuine, amazing listener. And you always give such great advice. And I've always appreciated that about you. And um, I cherish so many memories. Um, some of my favorite memories are post-college when we both lived in Dallas and we got to spend time together and we were both just getting ready to start families and I got to meet baby James when he was born. That was such a sweet memory. Um, I also cherish the memories of when our families spent a week together in Santa Fe and with the McKnight and I cherish every minute we've gotten to spend together on our Stapleton 3 reunion. Um, I have one of my favorite pictures I wanted to show you. Um, this is kind of where it all began, Stapleton 3. And I love this picture because you're kind of front and center. And it just reminds me of um, the bond that started many years ago and um, the friendship that are, um, the friendship that I have with you. And I really hope you have a wonderful birthday and I can't wait to see you again. I love you and I miss you. Happy birthday.